I want to tell the younger leaders who've been elected, part of the job that I have, and I have told my good brother and deputy Rigadi Gashagwa and the leaders here, part of the job we have is to mentor the younger people. Yeah, the new leaders. Uh, I want to assure you that we will help you, you know, to grow and we are going to have programs in the party to assist the new members to understand their role, to appreciate their responsibility, so that we want these members of parliament to be better than us. We want the younger leaders to be better than us as we go into the future. And uh, we will be available. Uh, we will call you whenever we see una piga piga corner to the Wanyorosha. You know? Many of you seated here, I have had occasion to call them and sit them down and tell them, please, Nyorosha hapa, Nini. And I am very happy that many of you are listening. We only want the best for you and we want the best for our country. If better leaders take over from us, we become a better country. <laughs> so we will assist you. And uh, whenever I know, I, I sometimes tell people things that are not very pleasant. Kuna mungine na muita na muambia, wewe, mambo ya pombe, upunguze ama uwache. Indio. Sasungine, it looks unkind, but that's what our father is supposed to do. <laughs> and, and I am happy that uh, whenever I do that, naona watu wanapunguza maneno, wanakuwa straight kidogo, tunaendelea pa moja. Indio. So whenever myself, Rigadi, or uh, my good brother Musalia, or one of the senior uh, leaders of uh, our Kenya Kwanza call you, it's not because of anything else. We just want to assist one another so that you become better leaders because that is the wealth of the leadership of our country. And, and, I, and I, we really want you to be better leaders, better than us. We are very proud if we have better leaders than ourselves. As I have said before, we have made a commitment that to improve oversight over our government and to give greater opportunity for legislators like yourself to interrogate what we are doing as government, our CSS, we are going to change the standing orders, hopefully, so that our CSS can come to the floor of the House and answer to your questions issues of a road in your constituency, a water project in your constituency, electricity project in your constituency, we are going to make it possible for us to be able to speak to you and to speak to your electorate directly from the floor of the house. And even as we uh, begin the process of assembling that government, we are going to make it abundantly clear to those who want to serve in our administration that they must be ready to face the people's representatives and answer their questions. I want to encourage you uh, as uh, members uh, of parliament. Your office is the constituency. Musisa how kwenda constituency. You know, I have seen many people who have lost because parliament can be a very interesting place. Unapata trip ya kwenda New York. Ukirudi, there is another trip to Mombasa. Ukirudi, there is another trip to another place. By the time unajua, it is one month since you went to the constituency. Here on your highway, ya kufuguswa na raya. Muna nihelewa? So please, constituency, ndiyo ofisi yako kwanza. That's the office. 
yeah, and you must report to the office as often as is practically possible. Make use of the floor of the house. The floor of the house is a very premium platform. Nobody, 50 million, 50 something million Kenyans, is only you who have the platform of parliament. So make sure you use that platform. Siku ya kwanza, ya pili, ya tatu, utakuwa natatemeka kidogo, kiswahili, inaribika, kingereza, inakuwama, lakini pole pole. You know? <laughs> they say practice makes perfect. Sindio? Make sure, don't give up. And I want to ask the senior members of the house who are here, please, make sure na our two speakers, by God's grace, expose the new members. You know, give them a chance to speak. Watafanya makosa, yeah, kidogo, kidogo hapo, but progressively we will um, we will get good uh, good 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 legislators. So uh, Don't also shy away from the media. You know, don't run away from the media. Be careful, but don't run away from the media. We consulted with uh, some of the party leaders and uh, and uh, leaders in our in our in our alliance and uh, unless we get uh, a different suggestion from from the floor we settled on uh, Moses Wetangula for the speaker of the National Assembly <coughs> <coughs> And I am going to ask him to come here shortly. Because I'm going to ask him to come here shortly. Eh? Is it right? I'm going to ask him to come here shortly. Because I'm going to ask him to Pia, uh, we are recommending to you, subject again to your approval, uh, for Senate, we are recommending Amazon Jeff King. Uh, Amazon Jeff King, both these two gentlemen are lawyers. We, I, can, I can vouch that uh, if I had my own vote, I would vote for them. If I, if I was a voter, because I, I can vouch that they have been committed to our cause, and uh, we are presenting uh, these two gentlemen as uh, the Speaker for Senate and National Assembly, subject to your concurrence and approval, because you will be the people to vote. We also, after consultations, we are presenting to you uh, Lady uh, Boss Cholet. So, uh, yeah. so, uh, uh, unless... <laughs> I mean, the ladies particularly seem to approve. <laughs> and also, we are presenting Kaduri Murungi. Uh, that's a good gentleman from uh, Meru County as a, as a deputy uh, speaker for the, for the Senate. Both Chile is for the National Assembly. Again, subject to your approval because uh, we 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 want to we want to do this together we are competing with a very desperate team i just want to uh, let you know as members of parliament here we have a good margin of about 11 members in the national assembly we have other members who are not sitting here but they will vote for us maybe possibly another 15 or so 
but uh, maybe towards 20. So we will have a bigger margin uh, in Parliament, but let us not take anything for granted. Yeah. People who can use the National, the, uh, National Security Advisory Committee to try and overturn sure. the will of the people, they can do worse. Yes. They are very desperate to have the Speaker of either House. So I want to ask you uh, for this, uh, for today and tomorrow, please be careful. Uh, they could even possibly arrest some of you people just to reduce our numbers. Uh, so just be careful. I just want to ask all of us, we are dealing with a very desperate lot. As Rigadi has said, we come from a background where we hardly had any consultation. It was always a lecture, and we have to change that. I want to commit in this very first uh, uh, meeting that this consultation will be the modus operandi for Kenya. As, as the lawyers would say, this is how we are going to be doing business. We want to listen to everybody where it is possible. We want to uh, listen to the ideas uh, that you have. We want to share. Uh, there is no one of us who has a monopoly of knowledge. We can always learn from one another. We can always improve on the ideas we have. We must always be ready, beginning with myself, to give way for a good idea to give way to a better idea. It doesn't matter where it's coming from. So we will continue to process our discussions in this manner. As Rigadi has said, we come from a background where we hardly had any consultation. It was always a lecture, and we have to change that. I want to commit in this very first uh, uh, meeting that this consultation will be the modus operandi of Kenya. As, as the lawyers would say, this is how we are going to be doing business. We want to listen to everybody where it is possible. We want to uh, listen to the ideas uh, that you have. We want to share. Uh, there is no one of us who has a monopoly of knowledge. We can always learn from one another. We can always improve on the ideas we have. We must always be ready, beginning with myself, to give way for a good idea to give way to a better idea. It doesn't matter where it's coming from. So we will continue to process our discussions in this manner. Musikuwe na wasiwasi, kwamba pengine CDF vitapotea, haitapotea. Tutafanya kazi pamoja na nyinyi kwa sababu, not because of any other reason, but because CDF has really given us value for money in many areas. Uh, to our lady members of parliament, especially the women reps, uh, I worked with the, your former colleagues, we established the small fund that is there. We will be entertaining a discussion on how that fund can be enhanced. Uh, we know that uh, many women reps have been going through a lot of difficulty. They are judged by the same standards as members of parliament. And yet their kitty is maybe a tenth or maybe 20 percent of, of what it is so we will have a conversation and i want to ask 
the members of parliament here, especially the men. Please be kinder. <laughs> Please be kinder to our women members of parliament. They are not a threat to anybody. You know? They are they are they are, they are fewer than us. And therefore, I, I, I know the resistance that normally comes. Whenever we want to add uh, that kitty in a lete kelele, lakini, nitawauliza, we are going to have a conversation. And it's going to be a healthy conversation. And we will agree on how we can increase the efficiency of uh, our women representatives so that even them, they can assist in uh, growing our country without necessarily being in competition with with uh, with our constituents